How's it going, everybody? This is Mackenzie, and I'm here with another tour of uh, stuff that I've done in Minecraft. Um, I actually haven't done a whole lot since the last video, but I did want to go ahead and show off what I'm do I've done. Uh, we are standing at the harbor, and as you will see, I have uh, switched to a different texture pack from the default textures. Uh, really liking it so far. Um, first thing you'll notice is that the bridge that I showed you in the last video I did, I have uh, fleshed it out a little bit, given it a little more style, and we are going to head across that now. Um, sadly, the uh, excavations on the other side have not quite been what I've hoped. Whereas over here around Moria, I have been able to, uh, I can't usually go more than 10 blocks without finding a, uh, different chasm. Over on the other side, I have not been so lucky. So let's go on in the main entrance here. I like the, uh, new look of the glass very much, though it does sadly kind of, uh, ruin the effect of the, uh, chasm. It's a little harder to see all the way through. We're going to go ahead down. Down through the stair. So yeah, I'm definitely liking the new texture pack. Uh, and I think it's left a really neat feel to uh, what I've done here. And there we go. I know it probably would have been faster for me to just swim across, but I wanted to take some time to go through the tunnels and kind of show off the new texture pack a little bit. Uh, I did not make it myself. Uh, it is the uh, John Boy texture pack, if I remember the name correctly. Uh, something like that. Really fitting what I'm doing here well, though. Okay, so you'll remember I had basically just finished this bridge last time we were here. I have since dug into the mountain, and uh, what little I have found I've created myself. Like, this here was actually almost solid gravel. Uh... Sadly, it didn't lead me to anything, which was disappointing. This is the uh, little workshop I've set up. Did some woodwork, more woodwork in here, did a wood floor. Uh, I'm thinking to eventually turn the rest of the wall all to cobblestone, or I might go with the wood all the way around. I haven't decided yet. I kind of like the idea of the wood there just being an accent, not being the whole thing. Let's go ahead and go this way first. This was my first attempt, to re second attempt to really find something. As you can see, this is again, was all gravel and dirt. I didn't find much here. So I decided to just kind of go down. Let's go ahead and take this ladder down here. And this is actually going to take us... Here was another area I bumped into a bunch of dirt and gravel. And, uh, I decided to kind of clear it all out, and then I cleared some area around it once again to no real avail. So let's go ahead and continue the way down. This is going to take us the rest of the way down to bedrock. <clears throat> Went down all the way on accident. And sadly, this little chasm here is all that I found. Um... This is the extent of my underground mining has discovered so far down here. Um, I am down to bedrock level at this point pretty much. There's a, uh, you can see a block of it right there. This little pool of lava was here. I've ex made it grow a little bit by about two rows. Uh, it was here in like a uh, squared off room and that's all I've found so far. So hopefully next time I'm here, I'll have some new excavations and be able to actually do something here. Let's 
go ahead and head back up and I will show you the one other thing that I've done. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and hit the bed over here just in case. Because the next bit is outside and it'll be easier to do in the daylight.